Hey guys, this is Tech Doll, and I am super excited about the launch on March 7th of the iPad 3 at Apple's media event. Now, I thought, why not just kind of speculate about what they're going to throw into the iPad 3 that'll make it even better than the last two editions. Apple created quite a buzz at the Mobile World Congress in Barcelona when it advertently sent out its March 7th invite. Right at the end of the conference, where everyone was expecting some jaw-dropping launches, the thunder was stolen away by the Apple iPad 3, the news of its launch. While no one is sure what will be launched at the Yerba Center for Arts, which is a favorite unveiling ground for Apple, speculations are high and expectations are even higher. Some think that it's going to be the next gen iPad, we're presumably calling the iPad 3. Others think it might be the unveiling of an Apple TV. Let's see what they can possibly unveil on March 7th. The iPad 3 is expected to come with double the resolution of the iPad 2, also coming with a sharper resolution screen at 2048 by 1536 pixels. The iPad 3 might be powered by a quad-core A6 processor or perhaps a dual-core A5X chip processor. The iPad 3 is also expected to come with Siri, which is quite exciting. So in terms of the camera, we are expecting an upgrade. If we look back, the first generation of the iPad actually had no camera. The iPad 2 had a front and back camera. So obviously with the iPad 3, what we're looking at is probably an 8 megapixel camera, quite similar to the one on the iPhone 4. If rumors are to be believed, the iPad 3 will have an improvement in RAM. If we look back at history, they have always improved their RAM with the first iPad coming in at 256 megabytes of RAM, the second getting an upgrade for 512. So we think that it's going to come in at a full 1 GB of RAM in the iPad 3, which should be amazing. A new buttonless design? Some reports say that the new iPad will actually leave off the home button, which has become a core element in all of its iPad versions, its iPod Touch, and iPhone versions. We least expect this rumor to come true. The iPad 3 is not the only thing that is highly expected to be launched at this event. We also have heard rumors that Apple will actually come out with the new and improved Apple TV. Now, according to reports, the Apple set-top box actually sold out at Best Buy websites, leading to the speculation that Apple is gearing up to launch a new and improved Apple TV. It will support 1080p video. The earlier set-top box only supported 720 HD. Rationally speaking, with the launch of a next generation iPad, the prices of the iPad 2 will naturally go down. So a little bit of obvious advice is if you're looking to buy the Apple iPad 2, just wait a little bit until this launch. Another speculation doing the rounds is that the iPad 3 will actually come with the 4G LTE support. Who knows, let's wait and see. Okay, so let's wait and watch to see what Apple is actually going to unveil at their media event on March 7th. I will be back with the scoop on the iPad 3. Until then, this is TechDell signing off. Zai Chin.